The beautiful tiny island is located near the Siminal Island in Tai Tai, Philippines. These are the cluster islands sitting near the boundaries of its Asian neighbor Malaysia. Tai Tai is a home of peace-loving people in the southern part of the Philippines. Due to its near proximity to Malaysia, you can buy Malaysian products in some of the local stores in the area. The barter system is the oldest trade exchanges of goods without the use of physical money. You can still find and experience the actual barter trade in Barangay Batu Batu, Panglima Sugala. The Jo fishermen come to this market every Saturday to trade their marine products in exchange of agricultural crops like fruits and vegetables. In the local dialect, they call it Adla Pagdabudabu or Market Day. The Tai Tai group of islands are best known for their high-value seafoods like the kiracha, big groupers, abalone, octopus, delicious lobsters, and the sea centipede. Other high-value products such as the agar-agar seaweed are being sold in Sambuanga City, the Philippines' Latin city. To get to this island by plane, you need to travel from Manila to Sambuanga City and from Sambuanga to the Tai Tai Airport in Bondao. You can also travel by a ferry boat from Sambuanga City to Tai Tai. Be sure to contact in advance the Tai Tai Tourism Office before your trip. They will help you find tour operators and secure a boat. Sungai Siapo Island has a team of security personnel. It is their top priority to protect the tourists and visitors so that security is the least of your concerns. This will give you peace of mind and a more relaxing vibe during your travel. I will put in the description box the details of the provincial tourism officer and the cell phone number that you can contact if you decided to visit the Songhai Siapo Island. From Bongao you will have to travel 45 minutes by boat going to Songhai Siapo Island. The cost of island hopping which includes Panampangan Island and Siminal is in between 9,000 to 15,000 Philippine pesos or roughly $166 to $300. That is already good for 10 people. Since these places are tucked far away from the mainland, all transactions are made mostly in cash. No credit cards and expect not much of any of the ATM machines. So bring extra cash. Songhai Siapo Island is so small that you can roam the entire island in just 10 minutes. Small as it may seem but its beauty will captivate the beach lovers of this world. This Maldives-inspired island has a powdery white sand beach with pristine crystal-clear turquoise waters. It has a beautiful designed cottage stilts and floating jetties that can be seen floating in the distance. There is not much activities here compared to Boracay. Aside from swimming and free diving, you can snorkel around the shallow waters to enjoy the marine life.